The world is changing fast and the pharma industry with it. Biologics represents one of the biggest opportunities that's facing the pharma industry. Like many other inventions, the lamina paste is actually made up of a few simple ideas. But taken together, these create a single new insight that is unique. We knew from the beginning that laminar paste capabilities went way beyond aerosols. That's why we decided to spin it out of inhalation sciences. But there is a problem. 80% of these new biologics are formulated as liquids, whereas 95% of the conventional drugs are formulated as dry powders, such as tablets or pills. Formulating drugs as liquids means that the handling and distribution is slowed down tremendously. And if you want to reach new markets, you have to install freezers and fridges all around the world. So pharma industries and health agencies are crying out for new formulations that can be handled with simple, swift and safe delivery in all climates. Drugs that are formulated as dry powders instead of liquids are cheaper and easier to transport and handle. Our technology, Lamina Pace, turns liquid solutions into dry powder, dry powder that can immediately be turned back into liquid solution at the treatment site. Every time we use laminar paste to dry a liquid solution, we create a new, robust dry powder formulation that we can patent and license out. For pharma companies, this means growing new markets and a crucial competitive advantage. Another commercial edge to Sikkim is that laminar paste has proven to function really well and is easy to operate. I would say that the technical risk is significantly reduced. It simply dries substances at room temperature, with one slow flow of spray on the inside meeting another flow of dry air on the outside. And at the end of this process, you will simply collect a fine dry powder on a filter paper. Current techniques either freeze or heat substances into powders. Typically, they use either minus 80 or plus 80 degree centigrade. So with delicate sensitive substances like biologics, there is a risk that their active ingredient won't stay active when facing those kind of temperatures. So with gentle micronization at room temperature, you instead will have a fine dry powder where the active ingredient still remains active. In the fast moving pharma landscape, I believe that dry formulations of new biologics will be at the center. We'll see a landscape where patients, even with chronic diseases, will be able to bring their medicines with them wherever they go. A new generation of dry powder therapies means new markets, new biological formulations, and new patents for the most competitive pharma companies. <laughs>